Cześć, z tej strony to i na samym początku chciałbym Was zaprosić na dmarket.com, gdzie możecie kupić lub sprzedać skin do CSGO. Żeby dokonać jakiejkolwiek transakcji na stronie musicie założyć konto, a później powiązać się z Waszym Steamem. Jeśli chcecie sprzedać swojego skina, to najpierw musicie zdepozytować go na stronie, a następnie ustalać jego ceny. Gdy już uda Wam się go sprzedać, to zarobione pieniądze możecie przeznaczyć na zakup jakiegoś innego skina lub po prostu wypłacić sobie dostępne środki na Paypala. Link do stronki znajdziecie w opisie, a ja Was zapraszam do oglądania. Live into this pistol on the Duke to start on the CT side, but it's going to be nothing fancy from Navi. And look at this pushing downstairs. They're going to retake this bomb site, but they might be able to stop them even getting up towards sandbags. They're turning the corner. No one from energy is peeking this. It's quiet now that they're in the beam bomb site. Where does that go? Where does that pressure come from? Ooh. There's Ethan out of the sky is Edward. Yeah, he didn't even touch the ground and he was dead. So four versus five, they get the one kill, but they still need the retake. And Susan Flamey have got a very mean crossfire set up. Flamey taking the face right off of Fugly. And more might become actually, they can't get out to get this retake in. Simple gonna be taking down Ethan. NRG, they had the setup they wanted, but they can't get anywhere right now. That is gonna be out. Great kill for Flamey, triple for him and Navi make that round look easy. Fountain, he's falling back, but they've actually set a trap. Look at Simple hiding in the corner. How far in are they gonna peek? There's a headshot, oh my god! Following it up, an electronic with one of his own. Simple just wants four. He's eating all of them, quad kill for him. Oh my god! The best player in the world, ladies and gentlemen. And he just looks up like we all knew that was gonna happen. What a casual way to just, just deconstruct NRG. It's been some time. Hard part is now if they want to flush him out of that position, they run into the danger of rolling right into Simple's crosshair. And they did that on the pistol round when they were trying to chase down Zeus. There it is from stairs. Electronic, he's going to get a triple. That's a beautiful adjustment over to Cirque. He's demolishing everyone. They can't even get by him, much less Simple after that. And he's still there to keep his teammate alive. Electronic's going to disappear down the stairs. Ethan's going to try for the hunt, and now energy starts to respond. Yeah, but it might have been just a bit too late. Simple almost flashing himself into a kill there. Again, 30 seconds. NRG are having a hard time getting map control without losing almost all of the clock. And Fugly trying to hunt Simple down. He's just waiting on top of the trash can and he's going to take down Fugly. Oh, you really don't want to be hunting Simple for very long either. And Ethan now, one versus three. Almost no time. He's going to try and go for the bomb plant. That will help them out. Electronic has shown up. Try and see if he can close out the round and he's going to be able to. A great quad kill in the round for him. Simple took a bit of grenade damage, I think, in the connector earlier. So things have reset for a minute. Flamey and Seuss are going to go and peek the L bend again. And this time, Ethan can't win the fight. They will try and run up behind. It doesn't matter. Simple going to take down Cirque. Flamey with the kill on Fugly, and now Simple crouching in, and he's not going to miss the shot. Breeze out of the round, and in a one versus four, with no bomb and just not the weapons for it. He's going to go down 16-8 in favor of Navi on map number one of the Grand Finals. That's a very convincing win. Yeah, you're not going to get that kind of gift repeatedly, especially against the better teams. Look at Flamey. The rest of Navi heading towards the B-bomb side. Flamey's just got him distracted. Just some, uh, some very light nade usage. Not really going to do a whole lot. And Flamey wants to gain some bonus money with his SMG. So he gains a deeper angle into the bomb site as his teammates have spotted no one. He knows likely it's going to be a stack. That nade misses its mark, and thankfully so. Flamey might have eaten that one. They're going to push on him, trying to make him uncomfortable, but he's going to be able to handle this. Yeah, just falling back around the corner. He's actually doing a pretty good job. Now the clock is out. He's going to stand and fight, and he will take out every single one. What a great ace. They thought they had him on the run. <laughs> All the UMP bullets gone. Ethan saw him, and... Now he definitely has. Edward gonna get one kill. Simple still picks up the headshot. That was brutal. Ethan, I think he actually realized a little bit early on. Team kill coming in. I think maybe Fugly would have had that one regardless, but a little bit uncomfortable. Daps cheating through the smoke. No bomb part has happened yet. In fact, it's quite far away, but they can wait for Edward, who's flanking through the B bomb site. They don't, they just have to talk to each other right now, and they probably win the round. I feel like they're calling for a save, maybe, but that might actually prompt them to go back for it. And we just didn't realize the bomb was down and we're thinking the B bomb site was going to be open, but Cirque still handles the flank. You can see again Simple getting a little bit loose with his decision making. And this is a this is a tough read for Navi, and yeah, that's gonna be an easy kill. Flamey misses the jump. Electronics gotta go back for the fight, but it's gonna be a triple for Cirque. How does he play this off angle? Edward is already in the cubby and Ethan just backs off. That's not the worst decision in the world. 
be very hard to stay on that bomb side and fight. You could tell that he was thinking about it for a minute. Edward snuck underneath. Is he going to be able to find it? He must have heard that gun go off. Three smoking CT spawn. The bomb is already planted. This is a very quick execute for Navi. Two smokes go to CT spawn, though, so that's one they won't have later. There's no flank coming in, but you can see Simple rotating back. Now he's going to speed things up. There are kits. NRG can take their time. They need to be aware of Simple's position. He's coming from mid. He's going to have a huge backstab. You talked about highlight reels. Well, this might be one of them. They line up for him. He sprays both of them down. Fungly and Breeze, no chance whatsoever. And a headshot to follow up. And that is absolutely the round. Pulls still alive and Edward covering him as well. Out in the open, that's a good shot and almost able to do it. Ethan has taken no damage whatsoever. Edward, is he going to try and back out of the bomb site? He's got 50 seconds. He's going to run for it. Nice kill for Ethan. Really nice kill, and also, I mean, it had to be fast. Uh, Edward's not even to trade it as he slides out. Look at this read from Ethan. This is actually really smart from Ethan on the defensive side, and a one-on-one -on -one here puts himself on catwalk so he can hear footsteps if they head towards the B bomb site. He can get all the sound cues needed. Also spotting over halfway into that A bomb site. He's got himself poised, and Edward is just is guessing. 16 HP, he's hoping the timing is with him, and he just, look at Simple. He's already up, he spots one going away, and he's, it's just on the prowl, isn't he? It's just so quick he's gotten here. It's almost like he's deathmatching. Breeze and CT spawn gonna try and make something happen with Flame. He's already got the angle and Breeze hasn't even seen anyone. He's already down to half HP. That's gonna be stressful. Now he's telling his teammates to start rotating over, but they're just gonna rotate into the waiting arms of Simple, who's gonna have a field day. Waiting around the corner, trigger discipline. Oh, the knife is out, but they've gone already too far past. There's the spray, all three. Breeze finally shuts him down. Saved him a bit of uh, ringing ears there. Well, gonna be just fine, no headaches. Three to four, and still pushing the bomb site. Actually gonna get caught with the Molotov in hand, and Daps and Breeze getting a couple of kills in. Daps now, one versus two. Edward is very low on health. If he had any kind of HE, that might actually be a bit interesting. But right now, he's gonna worry about the fact that the bomb is about to go down. Does he want to challenge it? He must have heard that sound. But he's just waiting for the smoke to disappear. Now going to be jumping up. That's a great headshot from Daps. He might be able to do it. Indeed he will. Taking down Edward. A great job. Triple kill for Daps. Finding them before they start to really fall back and hide. No disguising it at this point. One round away from $125,000. Flamey going to open up. Trying to see if he can get it. Almost takes down Ethan. And the follow up from Electronic. Long range spray and maybe a bit too long. They are just running in one at a time, Navi, trying to see if they can be the first to maybe make this happen. And Circus finally cut enough of it. Three good kills of the round, a quad kill for him, in fact. And now Seuss, the last one left. Can Circ get that ace? I feel like that would be consolation prize at this point. Looking for it, and he's going to be able to pick it up. Not much of a smile, not much of a celebration, but... Oh, you like to see that, though. He's, he's still thinking of the next round, right? He's like, great, I, I've gotten to the ace, but has the off, and it's a matter of time. Ethan has been great this tournament. I don't know if he can keep them alive here. It is looking like it will be the tournament, and going to try and get this bomb planted. That's so stressful. Ethan is going to pick up the one kill there. Edward going down. Now has to try and see if he can clutch it. They're coming for him, and he's got a little bit of armor as well, so this can actually work out. Smoking off once. He knows they're coming. Good headshot. Simple going to be walking around the corner. It'd be fitting if he close out the grand finals. Ethan hiding behind the smoke and simple. He's got the pistol out now instead. Doesn't even want to use. He's hiding inside of the smoke. And when it fades, he's not going to be ready. Simple to close it out. Picks it up and he's going to run straight for the defuse. 16-7. And now we are going to be able to take it away. Star Series I-League Season 5 champions. It's going to be Na'Vi. And so fitting as well. Zeus plays great down the stretch of the game. And even he's happy to have it. Simple coming through the smoke to grab a double kill. That's got to be a heartbreaking, heartbreaking round to end. Down on the stage, you see everybody in the crowd standing up. Here they are, your champions, ladies and gentlemen. Navi.